Day three, working on the bus. Today, my goal is to take off all the decals that are under here, as well as the ones that say emergency exit. We already got off this, which said diesel only. And for that, we are using heat gun scraper tool. Once you have one edge up, you can just really peel the rest off. So as I was taking the decals off, the letters became even more apparent, which felt like moving backwards in progress. By the end of all of this peeling, my fingers were numb, and it took a lot longer than I expected. The next step for us was to start sanding off the letters so that you didn't see them anymore and had a flat surface. About two and a half hours later, gotten off most of the main decals, emergency exits are still up there, but take you around the other side. This needs to get sanded down, and then this side needs to get sanded down as well. Calling it quits for the day. Also, got these lights out in the back up here and the ones in the front and we replaced this because um we backed into a fence the first day we got it uh and it broke so that's day three quick update on the front that's what the front is looking like All right, I think it's day five in the bus. Jalen was able to stop by for like an hour today, help out. He took off the, um, the door and some fans. The door thing, I don't know. The door's on, just the thing that controls the door. I got up all the, most of the rubber on the floor, except the part over here, it's under the heater and a little bit in the front by the driver's seat. Came up pretty easy in solid strips, but my concern is one, when we get this plywood up, what it's gonna look like if there's gonna be rust holes. And also that this whole front section is just like soaking wet. Ripping this up, it was all wet, so moist. So that just seems bad. We'll see what happens. today, all right? They, 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 get, they halfway out. They're halfway out. Halfway out. We're we spilled at, some coolant. We're looking at just a little bit of surface rust, so no Hopefully. big deal yet. Fender wheel, wells look good. And um, we got the heaters out. That was what I was most worried about, just getting the heaters out. We only spilled a little coolant though. This is Chris, long time homie. 
coming to help out today. Thanks, Chris. Yeah, thanks, Chris. No problem, man. <laughs> more than those two buckets in there. Ew. All right, let me get this corn on my hands. It's kind of burning. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I rinsed mine. Yeah. So I'm going to cut it back. You can load it up to go to the, what's it called? Metal World. Metal World. Metal World. Hopefully we'll get some money back. Money for gas. Fun amusement park never. It was uh it was just twelve bucks to drop on a um, I think okay. we're probably high enough. No, we've got straps with the okay. So should we start alternating again? Like twelve yeah, yeah, yeah. Somewhat. The same. Whatever works. That's yeah, right. we get uh it'll go down I, right there. I mean it'll I think it's right here, yeah. Yes, yeah, slide in on that one. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. That's oh, a yeah. short part. Oh, yeah. Oh, If you're fortunate enough to use air tools, do it. It makes the job a whole lot less strenuous. We used an air hammer to get this done. Popped all the little rivets, now I'm trying to chisel them off. It looks way easier when people do it online. It's not that it's hard. It just takes me a couple passes to get the whole thing off. After using the pointed tip tool to pop in all of the little nipples, you put on the chisel tool and swipe off the rest of the rivet. This was hard to get a really good angle for a clear cut. The chisel tool will start to dull, and when it does, you'll want to take a grinder to sharpen it back up. He's back from the dump with an empty truck full. <laughs> hey, Voyager. We have another helper. If you haven't seen our last video, we were able to rip out all the seats, so go check that out. And don't forget to like and subscribe.
Doesn't want to budge. Move on. No, I can't. Okay, I'm just gonna move on and come back. <laughs> 